the most important challenge is the speed of innovation. So uh, technology is uh, developing in an exponential pace and the adoption of technology is also happening extremely fast. And the challenge is to adopt the regulations and policies to that exponential growth of the technology adoption. Do you have the idea that you're always two steps behind the bad guys in this respect, or do you believe that it's uh, an even game? Oh, absolutely not. We are not behind. I think that we are anticipating the moves. I hope so. Uh, what we are doing at our center is actually we're bringing the policy understandings and as well as the research understanding how technology like artificial intelligence can be used by law enforcement to solve crime-related problems. So we are quite ahead of that. And at the same time, to understand how criminals, bad guys, can use artificial intelligence and to improve to preempt that and bring that type of knowledge and solution to the law enforcement agencies across the globe worldwide. Um, at the moment, many law enforcement agencies, agencies are seen as, well, maybe not bad guys, but not as good guys anymore either. Can digitization help them in this respect? Well, I think that digitization is a tool, so digitization doesn't help either way. What digitization does is to bring the new innovative solutions to solve old problems, like crime-related problems. Crime has been around as long as we are alive, but crime has also become sophisticated. Therefore, we need sophisticated tools like artificial intelligence and other exponential technologies to tackle those type of problems. And uh, knowledge and understanding of that across the board, across the world, is very important to ensure that everybody has an even type of access to those solutions. Yes. And what's the most important message that you would like to leave behind here today? The most important message is to ensure that innovation brings solutions, to ensure that no regulation will hinder the innovation, to maximize the benefits of the technology and minimize its risks.